So I'm here with Apprentice Raheem. Yeah, man. What are you saying to me? Good, my bro, yeah. You're all blessed, yeah? Yeah, man. Everything blessed. So we're kicking it off, like, show the people, actually, in, in fact, tell the people what you do. I'm a UK rapper. I'm a rapper. Okay. What kind of rapper are you? Why did you get into rapping? Like, obviously, like, my life, innit? There's things I've been through in my life. Like, I just want to talk my life, like, get me what I've been through. Like, plus, my brother, Lord Dellis, he makes music as well. What did you just say, your uncle? Yeah, my uncle Stephen Paul Dellenbank, he influenced my brother, Lord Zellis, to make music, and my brother influenced me. Obviously, my uncle passed away, like, and it was one of these dreams to, like, that like, used to make music and stuff. My brother just wants to fulfill his dream, basically. Doing the same my brother. Where are you looking to take your music to? Are you looking to take it high? Yeah. Okay, how high do you want to take it? Looking to take it really high, man. Yeah? High. Jeez. You want to be a face of something? Yeah, man. Okay. Why does Mandem get attracted to the road? Doing road? Uh, obviously, like, man's Man's on the road, innit? Like, get me. Man does road, man's out here. Get me. But why? It's just how it is, innit? Man's on road. Like, you're gonna do road, innit? You're on road. You're always on road. You're just gonna get used to being road. And music is a certain way to get yourself off the road, yeah. basically. Yeah. Yeah. What, what's your message in music? What, what you, um, given to the young kids at like your age as well? Yeah, obviously, man just tell them, tell them like, let me stay off the road, innit? What's the, what's the maddest thing you've seen, like, you know, out, out and about? Uh, someone gets stabbed. Yeah. yeah. It's horrible, yeah? Yeah. And it's something that, like, you, you're going to say to, like, other people not to experience. Yeah, you don't want to experience that. Yeah. What do you think's going through someone's mind, like doing it? What, like doing the stabbing? Yeah. Like, yeah must be angry, innit? Must yeah. Do it for a reason. What rappers do you follow and why do you follow them? Uh, like, I listen to a lot of road music, innit? So, like, man's on the road, so man listens to road music. Like, I follow, like, 6 7 and all that. See Biz Nines, the two pack big, like, they're real rappers, you know? two pack and big, real rapper. two pack mostly real rapper, Snoop Dogg. What do you think of um, graffiti and art? Because it is art, to yeah. be honest. Yeah. What do you think of art? Yeah, I like art, you know, it's creative, I like creativity, like, you know, it's good. Like, it's, the roads are mad, careful fam, you can get stabbed and grabbed and then put in a cab. Tied up and hit with a strap. This ain't no joke, fam. It goes for your back. Listen, fam, these niggas like they're sounding so whack. I'll be out here in the streets, I might be dressed in all black. If he's chatting shit, I will never lack. I'll catch him slipping and hit him with a few slap. Then I'll go back to the gaff, see the girl. She's looking all peng and that. So I just let her hit my bend and that. Then she'd be choking on the out here on the roads, so it's kinda mad. Listen, this ain't no joke, I don't mean to brag But I've been getting peas and fucking slags But on the other hand, it is a bit sad how life is Fam, I'm trying to get a nice crib And a nice whip with a nice chick That I don't have to call a bitch Cause I've been on the strip where niggas are getting dipped And people are sucking people for the bits And fam, if I see you with the class A Fam, I'm looking to plot on that Cause I'm trying to get a lot of stacks And fam, I run that back And listen fam, I'm on this track Hey, It was um, going back to last year Which was 2016 Something um, happened to you Do you like to um, say what happened to you? you and the uh, scar on your face Go and talk about it Obviously I got stabbed still Get me And um, why did you get stabbed? Obviously man them plotting on man innit and what's the hardest thing about music, would you say? Um, it's 
not about what you say these days, like really, like it's about what you say, but like real bars, like you're not like it's not just that in it. It's like it's about making a good song and a catchy song, and coming with like a different flow and a different way, like get me making up your own little thing to say. Are there any stories about um your brother Lord Sellis or? <laughs> <laughs> Sellis. Yeah. Any stories? Yeah. Um. One time, yeah, fucking, he was like, he thought he could beat me in a race, innit? And then I was like, cool, like, we're doing a long race now from my house to like sell us, like, five minute race. He said he's gonna win and all of this. So we started racing now. I've run there, I'm not tired and that. I look back and he's all out of breath and that, and just breathing heavily and that. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it is though? Like, obviously, he's about that drinking life, living. What three rules do you live by? Day to day. Three rules. Um, my word. Um, Lil E. And. Um, consistency. What would you say is the difference between rap and grime? Um. Grimes faster than rap. Also, like, um, there's this thing that a lot of people don't know about, or maybe upper class family. It's about hand me downs. What do you, what's your view on hand me downs? Do you reckon it's a good thing growing up to have that? Have what hand me downs? Yeah. What do you mean? Like, like say you like, okay, you got five brothers and they're older than you, yeah. and like, okay, you, okay, you're. Parents ain't that rich, so obviously you get their clothes and hand me down in a way as like showing brother I got you because you know like they say us black people <laughs> we don't really support each other like that and if they hadn't that from growing up they'd be understanding okay hand me down yeah man I think it's great to have brothers man yeah greatest mm. yeah. like the banter with brothers what what's the banter like yeah man <laughs> yeah. Banter. Funny. And Christmas must be good yeah. uh, when, when, when growing up, yeah? Yeah, man. Right. Each other growing, that's good to see all of that stuff. Good to have family, you know? Yeah. Especially if you're close and you talk to each other, innit? Yeah. Unless you don't like each other. Mm. Right, cool, man. Support, man, innit? Support me, fam. Like, obviously, I'm gonna come out with some tunes, innit? I'm gonna support, fam. Positive vibes, fam. Also, you said something about you're going to come out with some tunes. Your feature's on a new compilation album called CR Zero. Do you know the track that you're, you're featured on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm featured on, yeah, I know. I'm featured on a few of them tracks there. Still a couple of them. Got a couple tracks on it. Yeah, explain yeah. to us about um, one, of the, one of the tracks. <laughs> one of the tracks called um, Too Short to Box with the Lord. Yeah. And your crazy. bars in, in that, that yeah. track. Yeah, some, some fire there still. Yeah, some what what happened there? Then you was um, was it was that a dip? <laughs> <laughs> was that a diss towards someone to like get them to level up? Yeah, obviously you had a little diss gamma kid, you know, you know we had a, I had to put a little diss out there for gamma kid, you know, tell him to level up. You told the older, just like, you know, get me, chew your boats, the young young man coming true, you get me, with the ting. Get me. <laughs> get me. Get me. I have to tell man, settle down. Mmm. Mm. Yaga yai. So, a lot of people know, know his name, <laughs> K-Man, but who is he to you? That's my bro, man. My brother still. And what's going on with him? It's a bin right now, still. Yeah. Mm. And he's into his little music as well. Yeah, yeah. I'm doing a thing. What happened? Buys me things. Buys me things. Yeah. <laughs> he's a good brother as well. Like, just like Lord Sellers. Yeah, man. All right.